For Mashable, I'm Adam Falk. Once in a blue moon isn't just a figure of speech. It's a relatively rare celestial occurrence when a full moon happens twice in one month. The orbital period of the moon, that is, the time it takes the moon to make one full orbit around the Earth, is about 27 and a half days. So when the timing's just right, you'll see the moon at the beginning and at the end of the month. It happens every two and a half years or so, and the next one, the second full moon of August, will rise Friday night. And no, the moon's not actually blue when this happens. For its color to change, there has to be something in the atmosphere to affect its appearance. Smoke, for example, can give the moon a more red glow. One of the best examples of a really blue moon was back in 1883, when the volcanic island of Krakatoa blew five cubic miles of rock and ash into the atmosphere. Certain kinds of ash, if they're small enough, can block certain wavelengths of light. Ash particles one micron wide will scatter the red wavelengths of the moon's light and get you a blue moon. So to see an actual blue moon this Friday, you've got to be in the vicinity of an active volcano. What are the odds of that? For Mashable, I'm Adam Falk.